Want to say prayers up to uh, Coach Prime, Deion Sanders, as it looks as if he'll have emergency surgery uh, to fix some blood clots that is going on around his groin. Let's talk about it after the bumper. Stay tuned. What's going on, everybody? My name is Jeff Lighty Jr. This is the Victor Formation Sports Show right here on Jeff Lighty Jr. YouTube, Facebook, wherever you get your content. Do me a favor. Hit that like button. Hit that share button. Hit subscribe button because we upload all the time. Now, it was announced by uh, Pat McAfee and Adam Pacman Jones that Coach Prime, Deion Sanders, will have an emergency surgery uh, very, very soon uh, to fix some blood clots that are going on uh, in and around his groin area. I'm going to go ahead and go to an article written by uh, the On3, On3 Sports. Oh, that's not it. Hold on. Let me go ahead and go to the article written by On3 Sports to talk about what's going on uh, with Coach Prime, Deion Sanders. It says, a report Deion Sanders to undergo emergency surgery. A reading from On3, it says, Colorado head coach Deion Sanders is dealing with another serious medical issue, according to Pat McAfee. The sports broadcaster tweeted out Thursday afternoon that Sanders is undergoing an emergency surgery on Friday for a blood clot in his groin. McAfee received the news from Adam Pacman Jones, who appeared, excuse me, on the Pat McAfee show on Thursday. Jones spoke directly with Sanders ahead of releasing the news. Quote, there is some news coming out of Colorado about Coach Prime. Deion Sanders and I want to make sure I get this right. You were talking to him directly. A blood clot has been found in his groin, and he has emergency surgery happening on Friday. Uh, and Pac-Man responded, yep, at 6 a.m. I'll play for you some of the audio. Uh, just uh, and We won't show the video, but I'll play some of the audio. Just so you Serious can news. What's going on. And we got it because we're incredibly Let's lucky to have Adam Pac-Man Jones uh, with us every single week. There is some news coming out of Colorado yeah. about – Coach Prime, yeah. Deion Sanders, and I want to make sure I get this right. You were talking directly to him. A blood clot has been found in his groin. Yes. And he has, like, emergency surgery happening tomorrow. Yep, 6 a.m. Hey, Coach, come on now. Peace and peace. We're pulling for you, Coach. We are pulling for you. This comes after I think there was another surgery that was being talked about within the last couple of weeks. And what I find so incredible here is if you were to follow along – uh, with the Instagram, his Instagram, Colorado Buffalo's Instagram, yeah. or any other Instagram, mm -hmm. he's still coaching, still going, still working, what? still doing everything. It's like nothing has stopped. Yeah. And then you get some news like, oh, a big surgery is happening last week, and then that surgery kind of kind of disappeared from the conversation. And then this morning you say he's got a blood clot in his groin, has to have emergency surgery tomorrow. It's like, man, what all is going on with Dion, <laughs> Coach Prime, while he's still trying to lead a hundred and some men, it is quite a time for him. And let please let him know that the entire football world is like, come on, Prime, yeah. We're, you got this. You're literally better than everything. But we also hope that he doesn't have to continue to go through shit and just kind of do his thing. I, I told him. Yeah, so so there that was the report coming from uh, Pat McAfee and everything that's going on there uh, just with, with Deion Sanders. I'll go ahead. Oh, that is not. Oh, it's a commercial, I'm guessing. It's popped up KSC commercial. Uh, goes on to say, uh, so the first surgery that he was talking about, Deion and his team, they put out uh, the recording, the video of him meeting with a bunch of doctors. It was like three doctors. And they essentially said there's a possibility that he could lose his foot. So that was the first thing Pat talked about. I think that came out either a week, two weeks ago about him potentially losing his foot. Now this emergency surgery seems to have come out of you know nowhere. Uh, but that is some of the health complications that are going on with Deion Tennis. As we know, the blood clots in his leg is what caused him to lose two of his toes. Uh, so he he's had issues with blood clots before. Uh, this is coming up now in and around his groin area. Uh, that and, and you know the prayers up to Deion Sanders. You know we we've had our back and forth or whatever, but we, we never wish me myself. I will never wish any harm on him. I wish he uh, wish him a speedy recovery. I hope his surgery goes successfully. And just praying for him and his family, man, because th this is a serious thing. Uh, this this was a high high level athlete that put his body on the line for a number of years, doing two major sports at the highest level, playing professional baseball in the MLB and playing professional football in the NFL. And he did it for a very, very long time at a very, very high level, Hall of Famer, Pro Football Hall of Famer, College Football Hall of Famer. And But 
you know, doing that, he was literally quite literally putting his body on the line. And now he uh, seems to have run into a few health issues due to performing at such a high level. And so we're just wishing him the best, man. Uh, I really wish, you know, because he is the most talked about person in college football. He has the most talked about program in college football. And it, it just, you know, you wish him the health just for his well-being, for him and his family. And you also, you know, want him to be around to do what uh, to do what he said he wants to do. And that's to lead the Colorado fo- uh, football team, the Colorado Buffaloes football team, lead his son, Travis Hunter, and the rest of those guys there in Boulder. And we all want to see what it looks like with a healthy Deion Sanders. So you don't want uh, to see him not on the sidelines you because you, you know that's where he wants to be. You don't want to see him to be limited in any capacity and you just want him to be healthy to be okay uh, nobody nobody would wish you know wish this on him as far as his health and i mean this is the blood clots are very very serious you know we know blood clots can be very very serious they can be fatal if not taken care of uh, so uh, we just you know wish coach prime the best uh, and, and it'll be interesting to see how this, you know, hoping that he has a speedy recovery and is able to recover 100%, but how this does affect him uh, throughout the season if he has to have any other uh, emergency operations or if he has to have, take any time away from the game, from his team, from his players, his uh, football program, as we've seen he had to do in the past. And we know with Jackson State, when he had the blood clots, he was gone for a while. Coach Flea, uh, who's now also with him at Colorado, Ran a show at Jackson for a few weeks while Prime was taking care of things. And now uh, he's, he's got to take care of his health once again. So we're just hoping, wishing him the best, man, and hope that every everything ends up A-OK. Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. Coach Prime Deion Sanders uh, is dealing with blood clots, praying for him, wishing him the best. Uh, and, and he's got some blood clots going on around his in and around his groin area, and he's got to have emergency surgery. So just praying for him and hoping everything, the surgery goes successful and he's able to make 100 percent recovery. I'll leave your thoughts in the comments down below on the topic. My name is Jeff Lighty Jr. This is the Victor Formation Sports Show right here on Jeff Lighty Jr. YouTube, Facebook, wherever you get your content. Do me a favor. Hit that thumbs up button before you get out of here. Like, share and subscribe. Also, you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter at jlight 7 that is on instagram and twitter at jlight 7 thank you thank you thank you guys for tuning in praying for you coach prime hit that thumbs up button on your way out i'll see you next time peace